All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the SAF Under-16 Championship 2023 Finals match between India versus Bangladesh. My name is Sangeet Shafal and I'll be your commentator. Today it's going to be a very exciting match. The defending champion, India versus Bangladesh. This is the 8th edition of the SAF Under-16 Championship 2023, held right here in the iconic, historical Chang Limitham Football Stadium. And there we see the... Championship Cup of SAF Under-16 Championship 2023. We have a full house here in the Changmithang Football Stadium with a capacity of 15,000. And I believe it is a full house and the mood here in Changmithang is electrifying. You see a lot of Indian fans as well as Bangladeshi fans, but the mood is just amazing here. Supporters from all walks of life filling in the 1500, 15,000 capacity of Changmithang Football Stadium. We are about to bring out the official flag of SAF onto the pitch. That is the uh, Championship Cup. Which team is going to be lifting that at the end of 90 minutes today? Will it be India? Or will it be Bangladesh? India is the defending champion. This is the fourth time they're defending the championship. Last year they won against Nepal. They are the defending champions. We have a beautiful, beautiful weather here in the capital city of Bhutan, Thimphu City. The sun is down and it's gonna be perfect weather for some great football. Kickoff is at 6 p.m. Bhutan time. The 2023 Staff Under 16 Championship is the eighth edition of the Staff Under 16 Championship, an international football competition for men's under 17 national team organized by the South Asian Football Federation being held right here in the iconic Changmithang Football Stadium in the capital city of Bhutan, Thimphu City. <laughs> India, as I had mentioned before, are the defending champions who won their fourth title in 2022 by defeating Nepal in the finals. And today they are facing off Bangladesh. All the other teams have been eliminated. Previous match between Maldives and India, India scored eight goals and Bangladesh won with Just about eight more minutes left before the kickoff. And just to give you an idea, in this entire match, there were 25 goals scored in eight matches for an average of 3.12 goals per match. There we have the official flag being brought out into the pitch. And the top scorer, obviously, is from India. MD Arbash with three goals. Official referee Hassan Zahir, the uh, first assistant referee Ra Raouf, Raif, and second assistant referee Sumbar Hem Kumar, and the fourth official is going to be Bayan Jankar Kabin. And we have both of the teams there on the pitch, and we're going to be hearing the national anthems. Once again. 
again we have the Prime Minister of Bhutan coming out to greet the players, shaking the hands. In the red jersey is the team Bangladesh. I saw the team captain. The Prime Minister also shaking hands with the referees, the officials. And now greeting the Indian players. Prime Minister is accompanied by the President of the Bhutan Football Federation. A big round of applause for both of the teams today. It's going to be quite exciting. All the fans and the supporters are out. was the national anthem of India. Now the national anthem of countries. And we are about to start off as the players are shaking hands with the officials as well as each other. Team Bangladesh in the red and green jersey as well as Team India in the official blue jersey. See Team Bangladesh taking a photo session. Team India. Number six, the team captain, Mate. And we have the officials. Hussain Zahir is going to be the main referee of the match. First assistant referee Ralif Raif and second assistant referee Sunmar Sunwar Hem. And the fourth official is gonna be Bayan Jankar. And the two team captains exchange flags. And now the coin toss. Today it's going to be an interesting match. It's going to be a quite a physical match. Can Bangladesh overpower or gain ball possession? The great passing team that India is. And we have the first starting eleven of both of the teams introducing India's players. Ibam Suraj, the goalkeeper. Mate, the captain, jersey number six. Jersey number two, Karish. Jersey number four, Mohammed. Jersey number eight, Levi's. Jersey number 10, Arbash with three goals so far. And jersey number 11, Bharat. Jersey number 14, Vishal. Jersey number 20, Samson. Jersey number 21, uh, Yaipar. Ya I apologize. Yai Harimba. And jersey number 22, Tongamba. And now introducing the players from Bangladesh, the, the starting 11. Jersey number one, MD Nihadul Islam, the goalkeeper, as well as jersey number 10, the captain, Nazmul Huda Faisal. And jersey number two, MD Imran. Jersey number three, MD Siam. Jersey number four, MD Ismail. Jersey number six, MD Kamal. Jersey number seven, MD Bithu. Jersey number 11, MD Mursad. Jersey number 18, MD Abu. Jersey number 19, MD, MD Abu Saeed. And jersey number 20, Mong Singh Marma. And that makes up the starting 11 for Team Bangladesh. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're tuning in right now, you're watching the finals of the Staff Under-16 Championship 2023 right here from the iconic Changlumithang Football Stadium in the capital city of Bhutan, Pimpu City. 
Any second now. Team India coming off of a very strong performance against Maldives with eight goals. As we see there, the Changlumitang Football Stadium is packed. Just a full house. Lots of Indian supporters. Here we go, the kickoff. India, once again. Can they maintain ball possession with their short passes? Here's the long pass. And the defender not taking any chances. Bangladesh definitely enjoying the height advantage but India is a team that passes really well uses the midfield area really really well to construct plays and they're quite quick, quick when they come when it comes to making plays and here's a foul and a free kick situation for India the team captain number six Mate gonna be taking the free kick Mate, is it going to be Mate who's going to be taking the free kick? Yes, it is. Here's the free kick. It struck well. The header defended well there. And it's going to be a throw in for Team India. And that's going to be quite an issue for the aerial ball situation because Bangladesh does enjoy a height advantage. Their players are generally taller. And here's the long throw in from India. Header one. Possession maintained by Bangladesh. Defending well there. Last touch team India. It's going to be a throw in for Bangladesh. Bangladesh. Faisal keeps the ball possession from the left bank. But the flag is up that he might be an offside. That might have been an offside. Yes, it is. It is an offside. So it's going to be a free kick for Team India. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching the live coverage of the finals of the Staff Under-16 Championship 2023. The match between India versus Bangladesh. Here is India. He does well there. And it's a straight attack. Not so much power there. Easy for the goalkeeper. First attempt goes to Team India. Not a real threat there. Bangladesh. Good hustle there from India. And it's going to be throw in for Bangladesh. There's a bit of a protest there. But the official flagsman says no, it is going to be a throw in for Bangladesh. Faisal. Another throw in for Bangladesh. Sayam Omid with a throw in. India trying to clear that. Lots of emotion here in the stadium. Omid. It's going to be thrown in. Bit of a protest against the referee. But here is, comes India. Can this be a counter-attack? Cuts it in. Mate gives it off to number 11. Barat. And that ball will go out. It's going to be a throw-in for Bangladesh. And we see the head coach of Bangladesh, Rahman Moni. Throw-in. India takes the ball possession and we have the head coach of Team India, Mr. Ahmad. Bangladesh is making a run for it, defense does well there, he takes that out. 
buy some time for the rest of his teammates to come for the support. Here's the cross. Right into the goalkeeper's possession. And Bangladesh does really well with aerial ball situations. Throw in for Team India. A little bit more than five minutes. First half, the score stands nil nil. Both teams calm and collected so far. Header won by India. And that ball's gonna go out. India passing it back to the goalkeeper. Goalkeeper number 13. Suraj Singh. Here comes India. He does well there. Waiting for his support. Keeps it in play. Hits the cross. Blocked. And it's going to be a throw in. This is where India is very dangerous. Attacking from the flank. But Bangladesh steals that ball. Intercept it. India maintaining ball possession. Good pass. The cross. And headed off by the defense. Still with the ball possession is Team India. Cuts it in. Finds his teammate. There's the attack. This is the second attempt on target for India. Deflected out. It's going to be a throw in for Bangladesh. He tried to keep that in play, but referee blows the whistle there. It's going to be out. Throw in for Team India. Mohammed passing it off to Karish. Back to Mohammed. Gamba. Good challenge there by India. Good pass. Here comes India. And that's going to go right in. And the first goal made by India. Goal number one, India. What a fortunate incident. There was contact on the goalkeeper. He did make a save, but there was too much power there. He just went strolling right in. And look at the celebration from the fans of India. Goal number one, India. The defending champions taking the lead. What a great pass. And an equally stunning goal there. Chance of India is roaring on the crowd. Mohammed to Vishal. Bangladesh steals it but gives it right away. Suraj Singh, goalkeeper. Not, some, not a good control there from. Number eight, Levi's. Bangladesh. Heavy touch there, but keeps the ball possession. And there is a foul. It's going to be free kick for India.
Babish with a free kick. Fongamba. Back to the goalkeeper, Suraj. Kavish. Suraj. This long pass. And we can clearly see India always looking for those for those long passes, looking for the winger. They've done well. Can we throw in for Team Bangladesh? Bangladesh stolen by India. He does well there. Keeps the ball possession. Unfortunately, he's overpowered. Omit and the clearance. Bangladesh with the ball possession. They do have the advantage. It's a good pass, but he just couldn't keep that in play. Head coach from Team India, clearly frustrated. He's yelling at somebody. Perhaps the player down. He's yelling at the referee for not stopping the match. struck a little bit too hard but time and time again India utilizing that play looking for number 14 Vishal who's had a very good game throw in for India do remember to subscribe to our channel Sportsworks and we are gonna be having we're gonna be hosting or coverage of the live Coverage of SAF Under-19 Championship 2023 in Nepal, starting from September 2020, September 21st. So do tune in and do subscribe to Sportsworks for all the live coverage of the SAF Under-19 Championship 2023 held in Nepal, starting from September 2021. It's an opportunity for Bangladesh, but defended well there from India. Omid's going to be throwing that in. It's going to be a long throw in. Long throw in, header won by India, cleared out of danger. And now here comes on the counter attack India. Vishal, Vishal, free space. Here's the cross. And defended well there from Bangladesh. Now Bangladesh on the counter attack. He gets taken down. And there is a foul on that play. It's going to be free kick. Bangladesh. See there on the replay. Vishal making that move. Creating space. Using his speed. Vishal, the team captain of Bangladesh. Is he gonna be here? Is he gonna go for a direct attempt? It's a good, good position here. It's a good location. Here's an opportunity for Team Bangladesh to equalize. And he goes straight for it, and it's off target. Opportune missed 14 Bangladesh. As you see there on the replay. He finds the gap in between the wall in the near post, but it's way off target.
Header won by Bangladesh. He kept that into play, but defending well is India. Bit of a complaint there from the Indian team, suggesting that the ball had gone out, but that ball was in, it was on the line. And corner kick for Bangladesh. The first corner of the match, first corner for Bangladesh. And here's the corner. Defended well from the goalkeeper, punching that out. India on the counter attack. He's got plenty of space. He's got support. Defender did well there. Kept calm. Kept his cool. Bangladesh. Faisal attacking from the left flank. He's got enough support there. Takes his time, he gets taken down. Another free kick. Take a look at this corner. Struck really well right in the D area. But the goalkeeper was there punching that ball out. And the counter attack started from there, but defended well at the other end. And here's a free kick, another free kick situation for Bangladesh. The defender is going to be taking the free kick. Shallow, headed off, and that's going to go out. It's going to be a throw in for Bangladesh. Passing it back. Here's an opportunity for Bangladesh. But the goalkeeper brings it down. Referee's coming. Is there a foul there? No, there's no foul. Play. Great pass. He might have been offside, might not have, but he could just couldn't take advantage of that situation. Could have been an equalizing goal. They need to do better than that. These type of opportunity will be very, very less. India does defend well. Stadium. The goalkeeper is going to be okay. Do remember to subscribe to our channel Sportsworks for all the live coverage. And remember, we are going to have the live coverage of SAF Under 19 Championship 2023 held in Nepal starting from September 21st. kick header won by Bangladesh here comes Bangladesh he's got space good pass just a little heavy touch and the goalkeeper's gonna get that ball rolling out and there was a bit of a contact after that ball had gone out and the referee is gonna give him a yellow card that was unnecessary Totally unnecessary. He needs to do better than that. He needs to show some sort of maturity. But he does apologize. You see there in the replay, he's making the hustle for it. But and right there, right after the ball goes out, just pushes him in the back. 
unnecessary. Team India definitely utilizing their passing ability. And we see the head coach from Team India clearly upset. Well, his team does enjoy the lead with one goal. And that ball he just couldn't reach it. It's gonna go out. Throw in for Bangladesh. India winning the ball. Here comes India once again. It's a good ball in. Ooh, a near fatal mistake there by the defender from Bangladesh. Bit of a miscommunication. That could have gone in. Wow, Omit with a terrible, terrible mistake there. Luckily, the goalkeeper got a touch on that. Keeping that ball out could have been a fatal, fatal mistake there from Bangladesh. What a corner kick for India and Mate is going to be taking the corner kick. It's a quick pass to Vaishal. Intercepted is Bangladesh. Good ball in, just couldn't control it. And that just fizzles out. And the referee. It's going to be a free kick. I believe it was an offside, so it's going to be a free kick for India. He does well to hold off the defenders. And that ball is just going to go to the possession of the goalkeeper. tell the finals the nerves is definitely coming into factor for the Bangladeshis they nearly had a fatal mistake there by the defender omit number three trying to pass it back to the goalkeeper and just nearly put it in an own goal near own goal and that's the nerves coming into factor going to maintain ball possession and there is a foul there the first contact it's gonna be throw in for team India then we see in the replay just pushed from the back wasn't playing the ball at all, just... And that challenge has been rewarded. India with a free kick. And here comes the free kick, perhaps number 10. Yep, yeah. it's gotta be Mate, the, the team captain. And that ball is just gonna fizzle out. Bangladesh with a quick pass. There's a long pass. And that is way off target. Nowhere near the intended target.
last touch Bangladesh is going to be throwing for India. Kick for Bangladesh. And here comes Bangladesh. Not over for Bangladesh. He's got plenty of space to cross and defending well. But that was nowhere near the target, just launching it up into the air. He needs to do better than that if, uh, if they are to equalize. Stolen by Bangladesh. Here comes Bangladesh. Can he make anything of it? And the defender does well. It's going to be another corner kick for Bangladesh. Here we see on the replay. Omit with the cross. First touch deflecting, but number 20. He just launches it. No control, no balance there. Mong Singh Marma, number 20 from Bangladesh. But here's the corner, won by Bangladesh. Struck well, right into the D area. Header won by India. Fed right back in by his Bangladesh. And just no control. Throw in for Bangladesh. Let's take another look here. First header won by number four, the defender from India. Number 20, once again, just no control. He's just trying to attempt these acrobatic kicks and he's got no control. But stolen is Bangladesh. Here comes Bangladesh. Another great opportunity to attempt. Blocked. And cleared by the defenders of India. Team captain blocking twice, doing really well. And finally, number 10 clearing that ball out of danger. But this is what uh, Team Bangladesh needs to be, a, be a wary of. India has a very quick counter attack strategy. Hongamba with a throw in. Vishal, passing it all the way down to Krish, to Karish, to Mohammed. Here comes India. He's got space, but defender does well. Just couldn't make that run. It's going to be a long throw in. It's gone as far back as possible. There's the ball, bo ball boy. The 
the goalkeeper from India. Try to wash out his eyes. Maybe a piece of dust might have entered his eye. move there he loses the defender one defender but defending well is number three omit omit with a throw in it's gonna be another throw in for Bangladesh 31st minute of the first half. The goal standing. Still, India with one goal lead. Do remember to subscribe to our channel Sportsworks and we are also bringing you guys the live coverage of SAF Under-19 Championship 2023 held in Nepal starting from September 21st. September 21st. Maintain their first contact there, that first touch. He does well. Bangladesh, good pass off to the right flank. But the flag is up and it is offside. Vishal. 
लंबा हामिद हरीश गुड बॉल पोजेशन गुड मूव देर Intercepted, but India maintains the ball possession. Here they come from the left bank. Good ball in. Plenty of support. He's going to go straight for it, and here's an opportunity. But defended well. Not over yet. But blocked. Danger is still imminent. India is still pushing, but defending well. And finally, the clearance. there on the replay it's a cross it's blocked good defending there too much on that it's going to be easy for the goalkeeper Long pass. Finding the open space. Good passing there. And just too much on that. He knew he couldn't. reach the ball giving instruction is the head coach there from Bangladesh and we're going to have the first substitute number 8 in and number 11 out number 8 for Bangladesh is Abdullah Passing it back down to the defenders. Do remember to subscribe to our channel Sportsworks and we are going to also have the live coverage of the Under 19 Championship 2023 held in Nepal starting from September 21st. Good move. Here's India. Here's the cross. Good place in. Just no contact on the other end. Bangladesh coming quick off from the left flank. The captain winning the ball. Blocked and stolen by India. Feeds it up. Stolen by Bangladesh. Here's an opportunity. Too much on that pass. India. Here comes cross. It's a good idea. Good turn around, good pass. And now a long pass. Easy 
for the defender. Keeps it in play. Fortieth minute into the first half. India still with one goal lead. There is a foul on that play and it's gonna be free kick for India. Stealing the ball is Bangladesh. Good ball in. Here is Bangladesh. The cross and the attempt. Still chaos in the D area. The attempt blocked. And that ball's going to go out. It's going to be a corner kick. Take a look at the replay. Just a bit of a fumble there. He had the opportunity here, but blocked. It might have been a handball, but... Defending well is Tim India. Maintaining their one goal lead. For Bangladesh, uh, he had plenty of space there. He could have gone, made the attempt himself, but he decided to cross and that's where it just fizzled out that attack. Faisal, the captain, couldn't keep control of the ball. Do remember to subscribe to our channel, Sportworks, and remember we are also bringing you the live coverage of SAF Under-19 Championship 2023 held in Nepal, starting from September 21st. So do tune in for that. But right now you're watching the live coverage of the finals of SAF Under-16 Championship 2023, the match between India versus Bangladesh. Team India, Tongamba with a throw in. Defends well. Right back to India. Less than two minutes of the official time. Bangladesh wins the ball possession. Here comes Bangladesh, perhaps another attempt before the half time. by the defender. He needs to do better than that. Less than one minute of the official time before the half time. And the last touch is by Bangladesh, so it's going to be a corner kick for India. Here's another opportunity. I'm sure the referees will award an additional two to three minutes of additional time. But here comes the corner kick. India defended well, punched out by the goalkeeper.
Yes, two additional minutes added on. Good pass in. Heavy first touch. Bangladesh. Passing it back down, trying to spread out. Pressure on there. He cannot get it. Get the ball out of the D area. Yes, they do. Here's the team captain, Faisal. That was a good attempt, but a miscommunication there with the teammates. Didn't make that run. in a minute and India is going to maintain the lead with one goal in the first half throw in for India the referee just checked his watch Seconds left. And the defender's going to kick that ball out. It's going to be a throw in for India. Perhaps another attempt before the halftime. In there with the throw in. Across. And the header. But blocked by the defender. It's going to be another corner kick. Perhaps another chance here for India. Maybe to take the lead to two goals. Yes, they are going to have enough time for another corner kick. Just enough time for another corner kick. Here comes India. Corner kick. by Bangladesh and we might just run out with the time and there we have it that is gonna be the first half it's halftime India still maintaining the lead with one goal ladies and gentlemen it's gonna be an interesting second half Bangladesh needs to step it up a notch I'm sure it's gonna have they're gonna be having a very interesting conversation there in the locker room and as we see the fans of India celebrating with the lead in the first half, India won. Bangladesh nil. We'll be right back after the half time.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back after the halftime. This is the second half, and India still leading with one goal, Bangladesh nil. It's going to be an exciting second half. I'm sure a lot of strategies has been Plenty of time for Bangladesh to equalize. Bit of a contact there. Throw in for Bangladesh. And the flag is up. It's got to be offside. Tell Bangladesh is playing more offensive now. They have got more numbers in the upper field. Just giving away, but maintaining the ball possession. Bangladesh, he's making a run for it. The captain, he gets brought down. And no foul there. The referee just waving it off. Here we see the replay, a bit of a fumble. was intercepted but great pass there and he just makes the run Ooh, good defending there by number two he gets the ball it's gonna be a corner kick Karish Soram with a great defending there from India the captain of India is down. The play must go on. Danger's not over. Bangladesh! No power there. The header won by Bangladesh. But good defending there from number two. Once again, he's been defending really well for India. Foul on that play. It's going to be a free kick. Bangladesh certainly show, showing urgency in the second half. Switch it over to the left flank. Long pass. He's making the run for it. It's going to be too much on that. It's going to be out. Slow down pace. It's a long pass. 
Mate making a run for it. Keeps it in. Mate makes the move. Finds some space. Bit of a tussle there, and there is a foul, and it's going to be a free kick for India. Great move there. But he gets brought down. And this is a good place, good position for India to add on to the lead. There's an opportunity. The referee motioning the defender from Bangladesh to move backwards. Can India extend the lead with another goal here? And there was too much there. Too much on that free kick. Gonna let that ball go out for a goal kick. It's a long pass. Strong challenge, and it's going to be a free kick again, once again for India. What we see on the replay from the back. He's lucky he didn't get a yellow card for that. That was a bit of a strong challenge there. But a great opportunity for India once again. Do subscribe to our channel Sportsworks for all the live coverage and remember we are going to bring you the live coverage of SAF Under-19 Championship 2023 held in Nepal starting from September 21st. Here's the free kick. And that's going to be a throw in. out the defender does well to clear that ball the pass finds Mate from the left bank a heavy touch there and it's gonna be a corner kick last touch Bangladesh. India really creating some plays here now. They're gaining momentum. Here comes the corner kick. Defender does well there. And that ball's going to go out. for India once again. Defender does well. Definitely need to show some urgency here. Utilizing that long pass once again, but that's gonna go out too much on that pass. 
They haven't been really successful with these long passes so far. Intercepted. In there with a floater. Good first touch. Here comes the cross. Good cross. Here's another attempt. But off target. coverage and we are also bringing the live coverage of SAF under 19 championship 2023 held in Nepal starting from September 21 throw in for Bangladesh here comes Bangladesh he does well to keep ball possession Passing it back down. Bit of a miscommunication there. Last touch, India, so it's going to be thrown for Bangladesh. The defender does well to keep that ball. Kicking it out rather than the corner. And here's going to be a throw in for Bangladesh. It's going to be a long throw in. They're going to try to take advantage of their height. And it's going to be a corner.
corner kick. And the goalkeeper does well. Now here on the counter is India. Denied. Bangladesh has got plenty of support. Just not an accurate pass there. Mate. Mate. Deflect it. Bangladesh. Bangladesh. Overpowered. Good tackle there. Clean tackle. Here comes India. And he's going to go for it. saved it and there was a contact on that and that's going to be a yellow card on the striker it was after the ball was caught but there was no number 19 does really well there good cross but that was going to be a 50 50 chance and uh, for number eight it's unfortunate that he gets a yellow card but it was a 50-50 chance. He had to go for it. It was unfortunate that he struck the goalkeeper and the goalkeeper is down. Hopefully he's gonna be okay. Here's another angle of the attempt there. That was 50-50. Uh, obviously the goalkeeper clearly won. He was at the he reached the goal first. But number eight, he had to try it, he had to attempt it. He is one of the substitute. Do remember to subscribe to our channel Sportsworks for all the live coverage. And remember, we're bringing the live coverage of SAF Under 19 Championship 2023 in Nepal starting from September 21st. I believe uh, the goalkeeper was struck on the head. Hopefully he is going to be okay. Yes, he's getting up. He is going to be okay. Good goalkeeping. He took the risk. And it's unfortunate that he got hit. He was struck. Play. 
Good long pass. Not too much on that. Still not able to get a real attempt there. <laughs> Bit of a comical incident at there. The ball was the ball struck. The head coach of Bangladesh. Slight advantage in terms of ball possession. Defender not taking any chances. It's going to be throw in. It's going to, it's going to be a throw in for India. to equalize. That has been the story of the night for Bangladesh. Trying to attempt those long passes, just not being successful. But here is India. The flag stays down. The flag is up. down and it's gonna be there is no call on that it's actually a very good tackle he gets the ball good call from the referee
a substitute. Team Bangladesh trying to put in. They need some fresh legs on the pitch. The head coach of Team India. I'm sure he's quite happy with his players performing well. Yes, we are going to have a substitute. We're going to have two substitutes. Number 12 is coming in for Bangladesh. Mohammed La and number 14 is coming in. Shaikh Sangram. So two substitutes. So a defender and a striker. Do remember to subscribe to our channel Sportsworks for all the live coverage and we are also bringing you the live coverage of SAF 119 Championship 2023 which is going to be held in Nepal it's going to start from September 21st. Right now you're watching the live coverage of the finals of the SAF Under-16 Championship 2023 match between India versus Bangladesh. India with one goal. There's a corner kick for Bangladesh. Are chanting goal. Headed off by the defense. It's going to be another corner kick. Shoving going on there. Referee giving the warning. Here comes corner kick. The goalkeeper. What a move by like punching that out. And here's an attempt. Blocked. Too many blue shirts there. And now on the counter. And he's making a run for it. Long pass. Can he find his man? Yes, he does. He's going to keep it in play. Passing it down. Good pass, good move, and the attempt, and it's goal number two, what a goal! Levi's with the second goal of the match. Team India, and look at the celebration from the fans. India. Extending the lead with two goals. The second goal, Levi's. Just puts on the move, just creates that space, and the defender, poor defending from the defender. He just gave him enough space, and number eight, Levi's. He has the skills, and he puts it in the back of the net. Goal number two, India. Now India can relax with a comfortable lead. 73rd, 74th minute into the match. This is highly likely looking like India is going to take the championship. They are the favorites to win. Ooh, that was a high boot situation, an immediate yellow card. He is fortunate he didn't get a red card for that. Here's another angle. Puts on that nice crossover move and look at that defender just gives up on it. He needs to do better than that, but what a goal. What a goal. This does not take away anything from number eight, Levi's. He just puts on that move, creates that space, and he just knew where he wanted to put that in the back of the net. Goal number two. But at the other end of the field, there was a foul. And Bangladesh has a free kick. Remember to subscribe to our channel, Sportsworks. Here comes
comes the free kick for Bangladesh. They need to do better. Here's the corner kick. I apologize. He's the free kick, but defended well. Not another block there. Good defending there from India. Advantage given. Blocked. Defends well. India on the counter attack. Here's an opportunity, but there's a whistle. So from the free kick, struck really well there. Header is one, but defending well is number 20. India a heavy touch deflection but the defense is there Ooh, bait stolen Bangladesh cannot afford to slack off in the defense done well taken on his chest but that kick the slight kick as it came off his chest was a little bit too heavy It's 
going to be a goal kick for Bangladesh. Of the match, Bangladesh needs to hustle. They need to show some urgency. Otherwise, India is going to be taking the championship with ease. A long pass. And this time, it's accurate. And nothing comes of that. India has got plenty of space. Good pass in. Here comes from the left flank. Makes the move. Passes it down. He's got space. Blocked. Danger not over. Here's another attempt. And a good goal in. Third goal. Goal number three. India. Of the defense line, but Bangladesh on the other side of the field. Good defending, good defending there from India. Not giving him the chance, not giving him the space. But let's take a look at this. Not quite sure. Perhaps, yes, it was given offside. Six minutes now. Bangladesh. There's a cross. But blocked. Too many blue shirts there. Good defending there. Captain Faisal with the 
back, but blocked. And the second block there. No luck for Team Bangladesh. Trying to come up with another attack. But the goalkeeper is going to clear it. Less than five minutes. And it is not looking good for Bangladesh. Good interception by India. Stolen by Bangladesh. But cleared once again in India. India is going to just let the minutes and the seconds trickle down. Trying to waste as much time as possible. India is going to try to maintain ball possession. Finds an open space. Here comes India. What a great ball. But can he keep it in play? Yes, he does. And here's the attack. Plenty of power, but not on target. Bangladesh. Stolen by India. And there's a foul. It's going to be free kick India. And he gets get a yellow card. A challenge from the back, so obviously it's going to be a yellow card. This is not looking good for Bangladesh. Less than two minutes of official time remaining. Oh, this might be a great error. Bangladesh suffering from a lot of errors. You see there in the replay. He just miscommunicates, heads it. And that could have been disastrous. Bangladesh just panicking. Less than one minute left now. is taken quickly it's a quick pass and here is the cross header one by Bangladesh loose ball picks it up by India here's the attack that wasn't a bad attempt just couldn't get that curve and we're gonna have another substitute Last minute substitute from Team Bangladesh. 
Is it too little too late? Perhaps another so uh, additional five more minutes time added in the second half. Here's the cross blocked. Corner kick won by Bangladesh, but this might be too little too late. Here's the corner kick, struck low. behind that kick. <coughs> Just a bit off target from number 21. And we do have substitute from India. That's going to substitute. Even if they do score a goal, just 
be not enough time left in the added on time in the second half. Here's the free kick. Consolation goal. However, see the goalkeeper comes out, tries to clear it, but right in the possession of the Bangladeshi, but he just falls over. No real threat there. And it's any second now, the referee will be blowing the whistle. And we might just have it.
Garcia. And there we see the celebration is in full, full, full mood. With the uh, players from India waving the Indian flag. And we have it once again to the delight of the fans at the stadium. Celebration with the waving of the Indian flag on the pitch. Well deserved. India showing that they're the better team. Showing that they are the champions. Grand celebration.
Ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be the celebration moment for the winners of the SAF Under-16 Championship 2023, India. <coughs> so we have the players and the officials all out in the pitch. Officials from the South countries.
champion of 2023, your winner of 2023, Team India. And from all of us here at Sportsworks, we would like to bid you farewell.